Hello everyone, welcome back to Hammer and Anvil Gaming. This is my Total War Warhammer 3 Taliban of Pestilence campaign led by Epidemius on Legendary Difficulty. And in part four, we just finished off um, defeating uh, Boris Ursa, whatever his name is, I can't remember his first name. Um, but the rest of his faction still has a big army left. And uh, we've got an auto, we could auto it, but we lose all of our plague bearers pretty much. Um, so yeah, let's dive right in uh, and try and make this a bit more palatable a victory. What they got? I've never really ah. Uh, see, this is a relatively new unit. I haven't really seen these uh, ranger units that I assume can fire whilst moving. They got crossbows. Yeah, I I, I generally don't know much about Kislev since. Shadows have changed, to be honest. But we've got quite a few uh, exalted plague bearers. Got plenty of Winds of Magic, which is really nice. Uh, start deployment. We've still got one unit of rot flies, which is really nice. They've been with us since the start. Scribbling down on his little notepad. Um, we just go wide. I think we do, don't we? Gonna have a oh, we got him on a rock fly now. Okay, these two can go as a group then. Got our spellcaster on a uh, flying mount. It's pretty nice. Okay, their entire army is hidden. That's not good. We're probably going to get a lot of um, a lot of. Oh, we've got a spell that gives us more winds of magic. 160% uh, power recharge rates. Pretty nice. These guys should all throw their missiles before they engage. But they're not. They should be, but they're not. will be charging. I did hard group them. I don't know why they're not doing proper attack orders. Well. Ah, oh, we got him now. This is this is not going well for them. Right, 
Three, two, one. Oh. Okay, these Furies that we just summoned can chase some units. Plague Toads are having a great time. <laughs> okay, this was really easy. I was a little bit nervous, but no, this is... I don't know what the AI was doing. We're not going to catch him, are we? Oh, maybe we are. We have got... No, come on. What are my rock flies doing? Get him. Damn it. Close. Come on. <laughs> easily, easily a decisive victory. Gonna gradually phase out regular plague bearers in favor of exalted plague bearers, especially seeing as we've got that minus twenty percent upkeep cost reduction that uh, Epidemius has. It's pretty nice. Uh, were we in our own territory? That is the question. Are we going to get replenishment? Probably. I mean, we could get the 3% replenishment. Or we could get 37 infections. I think we get the infections. Crap. No, we won't. Victory over Kislev multiple times. Excellent. Dutment receives plague, the forest of decay. Not even our plague. I've been searching the nem my nemesis crown. Cool. Wow, again, I've lost. It's gone a bit like stuttery after you come out of a battle. It's really weird. 
seems to only affect me. Hopefully, if we have another battle, it should snap out of it again. I'm wondering if the recording is actually noticing it, or if it's just me. Oh, sorry. Right. Uh, physical resistance plus 10% for all demons is pretty nice. It's nice. What's his last thing? Perpetual Pestilence plus 10% hit points. Uh, the Tallyman's Blades upgraded. So it starts off... Oh no, that's not what I want. Must just be... Duration increased cooldown. Uh, no, let's get the Renitent. We mature as to our pathogens. Get arcane conduits. Um, could make him fighty, but I think we do want to give him missile resistance. Yeah, let's just take the auto now. Yeah, let's get Perpetual Pestilence now. Uh, the gun, the Rotfly, is now rank 18. He's nearly immortal. Um, we'd get a reduction in cost of fleshy abundance. Probably a good idea. Ten infections to turn. That's pretty nice. I've been playing the Malachi McKyson uh, campaign a bit and I'm trying to remember what's going on on this now. Uh, yeah, got an ally mission. So might want us to kill the Tsarina Katarin. Um, I won't worry about that just now, but they do also need a target. And he is smashing them over there. Let's get, send them to Occupy Prague. War host of the apocalypse. Uh, it might be good to get him to attack. No, I won't give him any missions because we want to take the settlements ourselves, but and then we got no shared enemies of the demon prince. Okay, that's all built. That's as upgraded as we can make it. This is not. So we want infections for sure. Creeks infections here. We could just build this. We have got the money, so let's do it. And then that's all of our buildings. Ooh. 
I'm getting 65 a turn now, which is pretty nice. Uh, or is that just because of post-battle stuff, probably? Any summon to level five, defeat six kiss, kill, ah, defeat armies in the fields. Uh, do we know how many we have done? No, it's not going to tell us. Recruit 30 units. I don't want to, though. I, I don't need to. Um, we'll come back to that. Send the turn. Raid Carrack Drum. Carrack Drum, we can do that. Ah, this guy's back. So let's see if we can find Tamakan. Who is over here, I want to say. Okay, well. Festus makes a lot of sense as an ally. Yep, let's get more infections per turn. Uh, income generate, and this is the place to recruit, apparently. Ah, if only we could get the Howling Citadel off them. It's going to be difficult to take off of him, isn't it? Mind you, it doesn't really matter because we can recruit units here anywhere, can't we? So, yeah, we can just easily recruit it there if we want to. It doesn't really matter where the buildings are. The next turn, we should be able to get the construction time reduction one. So th uh, re yeah, sorry, construction cost reduction. So we probably definitely want to start a plague there next turn. So we'll see what happens then. Uh, we've done diplomacy. Now we need to move on tribe slaughter. Stupid orcs have taken that. Oh wait, no, they haven't. That's a that's a a uh, camp pillar of skulls have taken uh, been taken by uh, who is this? Oh, tribal fury. Gorse. 
I've maxed out a lot of these. And we have got a mission to recruit more, so maybe we should be. We'll do it next turn. Where are these guys? Oh, they're all the way over here. No. Grant's line of sight when I play X-Men. I love that. That's so cool. Okay, so we want to do a plague. Um, we'll do... Corruption's at 100%, so it doesn't really matter. We've selected Forest to Decay. We'll do Construction Cost, Growth. Might as well do Corruption, I guess. Awesome. So now we've got a Construction Cost Reduction. Uh, what's this again? Income. Ribbon cost is pretty nice. Um, could go for... Defensive buildings, it gives us cultists. Or we could go for the big boy. The 340. I think we go for the big boy. Does construction cost include... Infections cost? I'm sure it must do, right? Well, we definitely want to get some of this stuff in. Plague Drones of Nurgle, Plague Drones, Pox Riders of Nurgle are good. So we get that as well. Cool, so now we're going to actually start getting decent units soon. gonna miss this damn it I knew I should have sprinted there didn't think about that sad Plus 150 favour when plague is spread to owned regions and forces. That's pretty cool. Summonable units, one Nurgling units when plague is spread to owned regions and forces. Okay. Cycle time minus one for basic military. Uh, no. No. These are all good. I like can't decide. Well, they're all they're all okay and stuff I want. Definitely 
want more infections. Okay, so he's sitting around doing basically nothing, so let's get some units. And get some good stuff from uh, the Legion of Chaos. Could get a Beast of Nurgle, Spawn of Nurgle is pretty nice. Forsaken of Nurgle. They've gotten heavy on core on Nurgle, actually, which is I don't know how it works. Is that linked to corruption? Because we have been spreading a lot of corruption their way. Let's see, apocalypse is pretty shit. So we could get ten plague bearers of exalted plague bearers. And that would be all of our money gone. Can't afford that many. We can afford five. Um, I think this is greedy, but. Some revivalists. Um, and then we go into the Empire, I guess. Uh, Alright, might as well help the orcs. Some more infections. Carry out a successful assassination on Sverkova Ostina. Okay, well we can send this guy to do that, hopefully. Uh, Locus of Virulence was pretty good. Buffing nearby units. Take this out. Growth, building upgrade available. Okay, this place is good. Um, let's build the rot fly thing actually. Sorry, the infections thing. Oh, get my words confused. Cool, so we'll get some more infections, some more control there. That will keep that settlement a bit more, a bit happier. Mm 
Master Lo <laughs> My. Hear me roar! Right, let's see if we can take out Kislev. Our kiln's going there anyway. Once I achieve true godhood, you may serve me. The joint war against Crimson Skull. That's only worth 1.1, what is even the point? <laughs> His fetid embrace! Oh, I only need two more units and then we've done that mission, which gives us... Icon of Eternal Virulence. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's end the turn. Oh, he took that as well, damn it. Right, the faction destroyed, Earth and Revivalists. He's now a constructor. Can't carry out that mission, it's been aborted because she's died. Everything rots. Yeah, let's send him down to see if we can find Tamar Khan. This was Tallyman's house as minus ten percent upkeep. Okay, still pretty, still worth it for sure. So let's go swap units. We'll also spread the plague. Oh wait, there's no plague anymore. Uh, yeah, we'll take those. Thank you. And you can have some. Yeah, they can have the, the Forsaken. Swelling bowels, swelling bowels. Make bowel sleep. <laughs> no. What? I am Van Mulder won a defensive alliance. We'll take that. Good organs. <laughs> Wastes, time, time. Jesus, it's like we're just we're just dominating the empire at this point. What do they need me for? All right, military alliance as well, sure. Oh, the hot hell pit's taken, is it? 
Okay. That would be like all of our money. Um, nothing we can build over here yet. No, not at the moment. Yeah, that's great to get more infections per turn. And then where do we go next? I guess we go to Kislev, right? We need to fight Kislev and Empire. It's kind of annoying we can't walk through these guys' lands. Yeah, maybe next turn we fight his quest battle before we do anything. Let's end the turn. Because if we fight that, we get 5,000 gold, a new item. All that good stuff. Nemesis crown claimed by Festus. Okay, yeah, let's uh, sound of sickness. Oof, this battle's no joke. Okay. Should be all right though. Got loads of exalted plague bearers. Lots of they got lots of they got a few chaff units. They got some peasants and stuff, but yeah, lots of cav, which might be a problem. But yeah, I think we fight it. We definitely give it a try. So we should be fighting at the White Tower of Hoef. <laughs> All the plague mountains.
There we go. Now we got the exalted in the center. Tonians will soon rally with a cure. Okay, time to rush them, I guess. <laughs> no spry. Damn, didn't mean to get hit by that. For your staff. Yes. So devastating. I love it. Yeah, where are they approaching from? Over there. Okay, cool. No problem. Don't know where they're going. <laughs> Maybe we should form up a line. Uh, probably should get down because I don't know if that guy's good at fighting or what. Good, we're getting shots off. We have no trebuchets, which is good for us.
Okay, cool. I think we've got him now. Okay, they're all dealing with all that. Light boiler is so much fun. I good. I will. I I gotta use it again, right? <laughs> oh, so good. Oh shit! I heal myself. Oh no, my rock flies. No, 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 no. They've been with me since the beginning. Draw them off, I think. No, oh man. Oh, that's so powerful. The grenades. Bit bummed about those rock flies, but oh well. They get more ammunition as well, it's just crazy. So good. Like, the additional, what is it, one or two volleys you can get with research? So powerful. Right, hopefully that's sorted out the 
stuttering. Like comes out if you like come out of a battle the second time, it's I think it normally fixes it. Don't know what's going on with that though. Don't know if it's just affecting me or uh, infections or replenishment. We're, we're not really at war with anyone, so we might as well take the. Re well, we're not. Sorry, we're not near any enemies, so we might as well take the infections. Five thousand fever, casualty replenishment, and then sands of sickness. Diplomatic relations plus fifteen for demons of chaos. Ability sands of sickness, which does thirty-five meter spread range. Melee damage reflection plus twenty on self. Okay, so it affects you, hurts enemies as well as yourself and buffs yourself. Minus five percent upkeep for Nurgle units. Very nice. Line trail ability, passivity, slime trail. Makes everything else <laughs> slow. Any enemy nearby enemy slow. And then let's do epidemic outburst. The other guy is now finally immortal. Yeah, good. Triumph in totality. Yeah, let's make blight oil costs. Enough, like a lot less. The Barons of the Bog, Pox Riders of Nurgle. Uh, let's get some more exalted plague bearers. Still getting replenishment. Okay, building upgrade. Uh, let's check our main settlement, main uh, province first. Nope, nothing here. Let's do this one because we haven't got any infections coming from this place. Let's not worry about that just yet. Mm. We're not making enough a turn yet. Uh, is it worth doing anyway? Probably. We could get minus one cycle time. We could go from growth and get these two. Does it overwrite the plague if you do it? Hang on.
replacing any existing fakes. Okay, we'll wait until next turn then. Um, did I look at the diplomacy? I probably did. War coordination. Uh, winter to winter tooth can. Oh my god, we're just stomping through them now. Yeah, nothing, nothing going on there. Nothing to do. Of the Fly Lord. Okay, taking our war target, uh, research done. Uh, friends in fetid places, capture and occupy a settlement belonging to an army. And then any of the following enemies of the pox makes a note. Well, that's a long way. Not really sure how long, oh, we've got forever to do it, which is pretty nice. All right, but uh, we'll end the recording there. Hope you all enjoyed this one. Uh, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in part six.